Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to determine the molecular geometry, shape and the bond angles for SCL2 molecule. It is a chemical formula for sulfur chloride. So to determine its molecular geometry, we first need to look at its lowest structure followed by its shape. This is the lowest structure of SCL2 and you might wonder that it's a linear molecule because all the atoms are arranged in the same plane. But wait, you have to look at it. Uh, you have to look at its 3D structure to understand uh, it better. So if you look at it in 3D, you can see that these two lone pairs of electrons on sulfur atom cause repulsive forces which force down the chlorine atoms to uh, you know, shift away from the linear position and it exerts forces on chlorine atoms such that the shape of the molecule is not linear. And as the shape of the molecule is not linear, it is bent. So this kind of shape is bent but the electron geometry for SCL2 is tetrahedral because uh, sulfur has four regions of uh, electrons because it has two lone pairs and two atoms it is bonding to. So the electron regions for central atoms are four. And if you look at the chart that is given over here using AXN notation, you can see that it has a notation of AX2E2 where A is a central atom, X is the number of atoms binding to it and E is the number of lone pairs on it. It has a bond angle of approximately 190. 9.5 degrees um, and it might not be exact for uh, this molecule it might be somewhere around 109.5 but this is the overall molecular geometry shape and bond angle for uh, SCL2 it is a bent molecule with a tetrahedral uh, electron geometry and approximately 109.5 degrees of bond angles. I hope this video helps you to understand the molecular geometry of this molecule and for more such videos on lowest structure, molecular geometry, polarity, hybridization of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.